divine gamti people cannot divide because religions are the branches of the namaste in sanskrit is there is going to represent a speech on the topic hindu culture 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 it what makes a person who he or she is today and what he or she will be in the upcoming future culture every person has their own unique lifestyle and their identity our belief and the morals of the people are made up by their culture which remains with them throughout their life a person is judged on the basis of their culture whether a good or a bad i personally belong to a hindu culture a very sophisticated culture combines different ethnical and moral values it is the oldest culture among the five major religions it has different form of gods and different moral principles the main or the important theory of this culture is the theory of karma which includes if a person do a good and have a good faith then he is a person who may get a good position in their upcoming life if a person does a bad thing then his position may go to a worse place the followers of hindu culture are known as hindus hindu are known to be a very friendly nature the main aim of a the body of a hindu culture is four different aims known as purushartas they include dharma karma artha and moksha the, there are different festivals in hindu culture it is said they celebrate a thousands of festivals every year these festivals are celebrated on the basis to purify and stimulate the vital power of nature though it's a good culture but it includes different bad customs like untouchability dowry system domestic violence gender discrimination and many more though they are our culture but can be eliminated from the society by the awareness they set a bad example for our upcoming futures and to our youth hence i want to conclude my speech saying that we need to preserve our culture as they are our identity